You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I'm back. Rudrance for Black and White Sports. Well, another day, yet another NFL player that is in a major bind, and we're talking about for some repugnant ass actions this time. I mean, not that any of them are really any good, but we're talking about the National Felon League here. Again, my goodness, we could start a second channel just on NFL arrest, it seems. Well, um, I can't remember. I saw an article the other day, by the way, where there's been, this may make 11 or 12 just since this, uh, this, the Pro Bowl when Alvin Kamara got, got busted for uh, wrecking that dude in that Las Vegas hotel. I mean, it's crazy. It's absolutely ludicrous. Okay, so let's get to this. This is a Texans running back, former Dallas Cowboy, uh, a TCU star, okay? Texans' Darius Anderson fake it, faces burglary with intent to rape charge after incident in Texas. Jesus, what's going on with the Texans? Wow. Houston Texans running back Darius Anderson was arrested Friday in Texas and faces a serious charge with the team about to open training camp ahead of the start of the 2022 season. I cannot imagine they won't release him. Anderson was charged with burglary with the intent to, let's just say, assault. I'm trying to clean this up for YouTube. After an incident last week in Houston, Harris County court records show his court date is set for Wednesday, quote, we are aware of the report involving Darius Anderson. We are gathering information and have no further comment at this time. The statement from the Texans late Monday to Fox News Digital. Anderson, 24, allegedly broke into a Houston home and pursued a woman into the bathroom. And later, the woman called the cops from the bathroom while Anderson left, according to PFT. He's now barred from visiting the victim's home and from per- possessing a firearm. He was added to the Texans practice squad in December towards the end of 2021 season. He spent time with the Colts and the Cowboys, but never appeared in an NFL game. Anderson was a standout football player at TCU. He had 768 rushing yards as a sophomore, 598 as a junior. And his senior year, he had 823 and managed to earn a spot in the senior bowl. So, Wow, what's going on with the Texans? That's absolutely crazy. I mean, another NFL arrest. Wow. Wow. Uh, Maybe Watson should have stayed in Houston. I don't know. I don't know. I hate to say that, but uh, it's awfully crazy. It's not the Texans' fault, obviously. Um are, are the city of Houston's, but you get you get the point. I'm a kid because I care. Yeah. Anyway, this is repugnant. Absolutely crazy. What's going on? I did a video on Sunday on Black and White Sports Two T O O. Go subscribe about Orson Charles and the Bengals pulling a gun on two cops, and here we are. I'm not even 48 hours later, and I'm doing another video involving another either former or current NFL player with potential, I mean, this is, I assume, would be a felony. Wow. Wow. Peace. I'm out. Till next time. Black and White Network supporters, make sure you check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. Link in the description. Use promo code USA First, all one word. USA First, all one word. 25% off now. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.